Greetings, Cindy Delecki here with Marketing To Go. Today I'm going to show you how to avoid your tweet on Twitter just kind of coming to an end. If you look here, see how there's a dot 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 at the end of this tweet or a dot 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 at the end of here? That means the post was probably scheduled on Facebook and Twitter in a scheduling platform like Hootsuite and the tweet was not edited to fit the character uh, maximum in Twitter. So what you would do is when you're in Hootsuite, I intentionally have a message that I know is more than 140 characters. Uh, you can see here I'm 503 um, characters over. See the minus right there on Twitter or on um, Hootsuite. Uh, so what I want to do is look for my Facebook and Twitter icon in Hootsuite. Go ahead and schedule it, schedule my post, let's just say tomorrow at noon, and then we hit schedule, and then what we want to do is we want to trim that way down for Twitter, and then we want to add some Twitter speak to it, if you will. So we're going to hit refresh so we can see our pending uh, tweets, and we'll hit refresh over here to see our pending Facebook posts. Uh, so here we go. So we're going to hit edit. And that's the post for tomorrow at noon. And you can see there's that dot, dot, dot. So we want to say, um, Nature's Nurse is committed to be a leader in research within the nutritional supplement industry. So we can maybe delete that. And how about we go to their website and copy the link to their website and post it here so they can read more about the nutritional supplement industry. And then let's go ahead and put a hashtag here by nutritional. Um, and that's perfect. All right, and then we just uh, need to get that out of the way there so we can save it. Let me shrink this down, there we go. So we want to go ahead and click schedule. And there you go. You can see your pending tweet here does not have a dot, dot, dot. And you've got a hashtag in there so people can find that um, uh, word or that uh, keyword more easily. Thanks a lot. Thanks for watching. This is Cindy Delecki with Marketing to Go.